Global Health is really the study of health around the world and with an emphasis on um, health in lower and middle income countries and an emphasis on health equity. I'm Dr. Ann Siebert Coleman. I'm Assistant Professor in Behavioral Sciences and Health Education. So in Global Health, we're interested both in what the health issues are and then from the public health perspective about how are we going to respond to them in that particular context. One example in global health is the recent spread of chikungunya in the Americas. And so it's a mosquito-borne vector disease. Um, those mosquitoes know no boundaries. They don't care whether they're in Honduras or Guatemala, El Salvador. But the response to how are we going to address this, what are our prevention steps going to be, that's very much driven by the country perspective and those international boundaries. We have to both understand the disease and its transmission patterns as well as what the context is in order to be able to respond. And being a college for public health and social justice, that interdisciplinary integrated nature lets us approach the health issues that we're addressing globally from a very interdisciplinary perspective. We really emphasize the social justice component of our name and that that translates into education and research in action that we're about trying to improve people's lives. Where students do their internship is really up to them and their interests, and then we can use our relationships with organizations around the world to help facilitate and make introductions to students to solidify those internships. This year we have students who are doing internships in the Democratic Republic of Congo, in Ethiopia, Honduras, Belize, Haiti. Employers are going to be looking that you have professional experience in a lower middle income country setting and that you have language proficiency. And so we have both the international internship requirement and the language proficiency requirement to help prepare our students to be competitive on the job market. In addition to just the global health concentration here, our students have the opportunity to select a joint concentration. So these joint concentrations will allow students to have in-depth technical skills in a particular area, as well as the contextual um, kind of applied experiential learning that's necessary for global health. The College for Public Health and Social Justice has a large number of international alums working around the world and in addition to the organizations that we have partnerships with, we are happy to connect students with those alums in terms of networking and potential opportunities either for internships or jobs post-graduation.